Tonight, after the longest standoff in 100 years, top Republican Kevin McCarthy is now within striking distance of the speaker's job. I'll have the vote. Well, what are you, what well, how, are why concerns? are you confident you have the vote? Kevin McCarthy is here. Because I can't. It comes after McCarthy and his allies spent hours hashing out a deal with some of the 20 hardline conservative holdouts. The outreach worked. Kevin McCarthy. Republican cheers on the floor each time a vote flipped to McCarthy. McCarthy. Part of the deal, that major concession by McCarthy to allow just one member to call for a vote to remove the speaker. That framework serves as, serves as the template by which we're going to be holding him accountable. But while 15 Republicans flip to McCarthy, six holdouts remain. Two more than McCarthy can afford in his quest for the top job. And many of the six seem dug in, still slamming McCarthy for not withdrawing. One must wonder, Madam Clerk, is this an exercise in vanity for someone who has done the math, taken the counts? But the few holdouts increasingly becoming isolated. Many Republicans leaving the floor in protest during that speech by Florida's Matt Gates, And other holdouts like Virginia's Bob Good not answering questions. You've been talking to us all week. Why not now about what the situation is? Meanwhile, the House remains completely shut down with limited constituent services and lawmakers not able to hold classified briefings with key government leaders. Today, McCarthy was pressed whether the current chaos is a sign of things to come for a narrow and divided Republican majority. Because it took this long, now we learned how to govern. So now we'll be able to get the job done. So, Ryan, McCarthy has the momentum, the optimism, but he hasn't sealed the deal yet, has he? Yeah, that's right, Lester. He still needs to win over at least two votes, but even his critics concede that he will likely get over the finish line, perhaps as soon as tonight when the House reconvenes. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.